Hello heroes and villains, welcome to Multiverse. The summer season all is almost here, let's talk about it. And right now we are on the test server. The summer season all has been added to the test server. Normally when, it, when a season all gets added to the test server, roughly two weeks later it gets added to the live server. So if you go to the live server and you don't see the summer season all just yet, it's because it is on the test server. So you're gonna have to wait roughly two weeks before we can see this on the live server. Uh, normally I do this a bit later, but where or where can you get the summer seasonal based items or the styles for that matter? You can see our friend the Atlantean Quartermaster over here. You can also go to the warp menu. You can see Tides of War. You can, you can also go there to be able to see another version of the Atlantean Quartermaster. And here we are on the hero side, uh, on the evil villain side. So you can see on the villain side, the vendor is the Mutineer Quartermaster. But it's the same vendor, uh, basically. Your efforts in defending Arthur's throne deserve reward. So basically, this year is uh, all the the summer seasonal rewards. But if we go by year, so this is the all the the items for 2022. So you can see the shark chibi accessory, and uh, that's the accessory you just saw me using. But I'll show it to you again in just a minute. The, the same for the king shark head. Uh, there's also some CRs here, so we'll take a look at that in just a minute. So for the ears, you have a head version or you have an accessory version. Uh, there's a seahorse fin, there's the shark melts from uplink device, and then there's a whole bunch of base items. I'll show you those base items in just a minute. So these are the items for this year. But then if you keep on scrolling, you'll see the items from last year and all the previous years. And there is also a shark back fin. So basically we have a shark back fin. We have now the headpiece. And there's also a pair of gloves that we can get in the, in the live server. So we have almost everything we need to recreate the evil king shark in this universe online. So here you can see obviously the king shark headpiece. And here you can see the Shibli shark accessory. And here we can see the seahorse fin. Now if we take a look at the seahorse ears. And obviously you can change the colors of the ears. They seem to support two colors. But also we have the seahorse ears as an accessory. Uh, it should be the very same thing. But obviously as you can see, we cannot have the shark uh, Shibli accessory anymore because we have the ears. But if we want to use a headpiece with the ears, we do have the option. So if you use the ears as an accessory, you can also use a headpiece with the ears. So that's why there's two versions of the ears, if you're wondering. So let's start consuming our new items. So you get a 50 point feat when you collect uh, the accessory. You get a 25 feet for the uh, the seahorse styles. When you and you get a 25 point feat once you collect 15 base items. Let's put our king shark head back and let, let us equip our shark fin. For the head, you may notice uh, basically it is linked to the skin color of your character. So for the fin, I'm gonna have to change one of my colors to kind of match the skin color. And there's a pair of shark gloves. Uh, sadly, I don't have them on a test server, I only have them on a live server. And now let's go take a look at the base items. This year, one of the base items we get a lot of is some buckets. So you can see here there's a group, a small group of buckets, but there's all, also a whole bunch of uh, single buckets. There's this one that's full of, I won't even speculate what that is. There's an empty one, and there's two buckets on the side for some reason. Like this one seems to be like a cleaner version, and this one not so clean. There's also a whole bunch of surfboards. And you can see the emblem, uh, basically whatever emblem you assign to your lair, you will see that emblem on the surfboards. So you can personalize personalize the surfboards if you want to. And you can see there's a whole bunch of them. Uh, if you like, if you take a look at the vendor, you'll see that there's a whole bunch of new base items this year, but a lot of those base items are all the different surfboards. And here we have an evil shark head that you can mount into the wall. And there's also a little pool uh, with a shark swimming in it. I know, oh, there he is. That's a cute, uh, 
Oh, a cute thing. And here we have some sort of hanging shark. Uh, this here is a small version. There's a bigger version for the leak hall, but you can uh, also fit it into your, your lair if you want to. And there is also an aquarium that you can mount into your wall. So pretty cool looking uh, base items. But there is here the, the small version. And here you get the big version. Ah, this one is pretty awesome. I can already imagine uh, some people putting uh, that base item everywhere on their walls. And we have also the beach towels on the sand. So this year they give us uh, the various evil villain mentors. Uh, we already had uh, the hero mentors for quite a while. And now it would seem they've decided to add uh, Lex Luthor, the evil Joker, and Cersei. So there you go. So if you were an evil villain and you felt uh, left out because you did not have a beach towel with your mentor, now you have one. Now let's go see our friend Aquaman. So obviously in order to be able to purchase those styles and base items from our friend the Atlantean Quartermaster, you will have you will need some sand dollars. Uh, you get sand dollars by playing uh, the summer seasonal missions and you start the summer seasonal missions by talking to our friend Aquaman. If you are an evil villain, you will have to talk to Ocean Master, but it's pretty much the same thing. If you're not sure where to go, again, go to the map, go to the warp menu. And you should see a warp to the Tides of War. In this case, it is Aquaman. But if you are an evil villain, it will be Ocean Master. So from the warp menu, if you are an evil villain, you will see Tides of War, Ocean Master. So it does take you to Ocean Master to get the missions. And you also have a version of the Mutineer Quartermaster over here. And now let us try out the Shark Maelstrom Uplink device. So let's target the Evil Deathstroke and let's get this party started. Ah, oh, that was cool. Let's try that again, but this time with the Combat Parser. Ah, that was cool. So there you go guys, so the summer seasonal is on the test server. So normally in roughly two weeks, it should be added to the live server. I guess we're gonna have to wait and see. 